guys, I am here to make my 19 through 23 week pregnancy update. I've been slacking a little bit. Um, I just haven't really felt like making videos and I don't want to force myself to when I just don't feel up to it. I am 23 weeks and 5 days today, so I'm almost 24 weeks. Um, I finally started the progesterone shots. Um, I go in tomorrow to get my fourth shot. I go in every Wednesday. I get a pretty bad reaction every time I get a shot. Um, it, where I get a shot, it gets swollen, super itchy, lots of bruising, and just... It'll be itchy for like two weeks or so. So that sucks, but they're definitely worth it because I don't want him to come early. They do make me a little more irritable, a little more moody, and I notice like the day I get it, um, I'll have some insomnia like that night. But that's pretty much it. They're not really making me gain a lot of weight like they did with my daughter because with my daughter I hadn't gained much weight until like 20 weeks when I started the shots and then I just I gained um, like 30 pounds from 20 weeks to 38 weeks so um, I felt like I was gaining too much weight and I talked to my midwife about it she's like no no you're fine we will definitely let you know if you're gaining too much weight and um, I feel like since then, it's really slowed down, so I'm not gaining as fast as I was. Part of that is just, I haven't really been feeling as hungry lately, and that might just be my um, medication that I'm on, but I don't really feel as hungry, and he's getting like really high up, so <clears throat> I feel like there's not much room for my food. When I eat, I get pretty full pretty fast since he's higher up he's been kicking me in the stomach <laughs> which does not feel good um, if I'm sitting upright it gets hard to breathe because my uterus feels like it's in my lungs um, I feel like it's too soon for it to be that high but I guess not I don't know my midwife says my uterus is right on track for where it should be at almost 24 weeks. He also likes to kick me very low. Like, he'll kick my bladder. I've been having some more frequent Braxton Hicks contractions. Um, nothing consistent though. Just a little more frequent than they were. But I'm not gonna worry if they're not like consistent. I finally have my anatomy scan on August 8th, so in a week I will get to see him again and I'm so excited. Hopefully he's still a boy. <laughs> For a couple weeks I was having insomnia like most nights. There's just no way I could fall asleep, it sucked. Or some nights I would fall asleep and then I'd wake up at like 3 in the morning and couldn't sleep until like six or seven in the morning um, but the last two nights I've gotten right to sleep and slept through the night so that's been really nice I definitely needed the sleep last week I was craving the York peppermint patties which I used to eat those all the time when I was little so I haven't been craving soda like I normally do if I don't have it that day uh, <clears throat> And when I do drink soda, I feel like I can't finish all of my soda because I just feel sick from it. This baby still does not have a name. He has a middle name, but no first name. Um, we can't seem to agree on a name. And it feels like he's just never going to have a name. I still don't have the line going down my belly. I remember having it with my last two. I just don't remember when I got it and maybe I'll still get it. I just don't know when. 
Uh, my belly button sticks out all the time. It kind of freaks me out because I don't like belly buttons. Some nights, like last night, I'll wake up to really bad round ligament pains. And I just, I can't move without being in a, a ton of pain. His heart rate this entire pregnancy has been 147. So it's been pretty consistent. This pregnancy has been the least eventful out of all three of my pregnancies and it seems to be going the fastest. Um, by this time with my daughter, I had already been in the hospital, I think just once, for consistent contractions. Uh, and then I remember being in and out of the hospital with my son, I just don't remember when. But I haven't been to the hospital yet, and that's, I hope to keep it that way. It has definitely been the easiest pregnancy physically, other than the pelvic pain I've been having, which actually lately has let up a lot, so I haven't been having too much pelvic pain. Mentally, it has been the hardest, though. Um, maybe it's because I'm away from my family. Um, I the only adult I have around really is my husband and then the only other people I see is my two kids most of my clothes don't fit me now which is upsetting <laughs> I should get more maternity clothes but we're kind of on a budget so I just keep wearing the same things over and over and washing them and then wearing them again. Lately it seems like my belly has shrunk. I don't know if he's been lower or something but my belly seems a lot smaller. This last few weeks that I haven't updated they haven't been very eventful. Nothing's really happened. Just starting the shots. Um, I definitely feel like he's been moving a lot more. He feels so much bigger and stronger. I've gained about 15 pounds, but yeah, 15 pounds is about normal to gain by now, so that's good. I think that's all for weeks 19 through 23. Um, I hope to get more videos up more frequently. I keep saying that, but I just haven't been feeling great at all, but I'm feeling better lately, so Hopefully you can see, this is 23 weeks, 5 days, it feels smaller, it's very weird. So I hope you enjoyed this update, thank you so much for watching and I will hopefully see you for week 24, bye.